all the things that we believe in, that's what we hear and see um, apparently around us, it is taking place in our own head, in our mind. And we believe that world of moving um, uh, forms and talking and uh, what we hear, what we see, the images that move and the, the opinions around our uh, being, what we hear and what we read in the paper and the, the journal, uh, whatever is taking place, we hear it and we see it and we are lost because we believe it. And it is nothing else than a story in your own mind. It is a play in your imagination, in the dream world of your, your um, not really being self. That what dreams this is not your real self, but we believe it. And there is something that knows this. This deep inside us is not visible, it's not to be heard, we cannot hear it, we cannot talk with it, oh yes, in a certain way we can, when we develop uh, more consciousness about it, but we are so taken by the movements in the outer world, which is outer, out of our deep consciousness outer in our mind, that means outer, here, in is here, in the deep self-being is in, and out is in your mind, and there is this world playing. It is only forms that appear and they talk and they have an opinion and they have actions and they have um, they share uh, um, meanings and they are uh, uh, fighting about meanings. It is all a play in your own mind, in the stage of your mind. All those puppets that you see, because when you look outside and you see people running there and walking and doing things, they are real, they seem real. And they move and they talk and they, they have an opinion about things. And that if you withdraw yourself in your real beingness, in the consciousness, I point to my heart because the heart is in fact that where everything appears from. The, the heart is the, the place the, from where all arises. So if you return to your heart, you can see the puppets playing. And amongst those puppets, it's your own form also. So it is just in the mind that it all takes place. This whole world is, it seems so real and we experience it real because that has to be. If we wouldn't experience it, we would not even learn from it and um, have the uh, possibility to see the truth. If we would not feel it, like you have uh, a story of Donald Duck and Mickey Mouse, well, it's funny, but you don't believe it. You know it's a nonsense, it's for joy. And when you see all Mickey Mouses and Donald Ducks around you, <laughs> you, you will feel that nonsense also, because it is not real, it's, it's puppets. You yourself are a puppet, and what are you? Goofy, or Donald Duck, or Mickey Mouse, or <laughs> the wolf, Midas the wolf, or whatever person, personality, they play a role in your mind, in the mind of the, the, the screen in your head, in your consciousness. The screen of your consciousness is filled with stories, puppets. See everything around you as um, a stage with puppets. 
you better close the curtains <laughs> if you believe the puppets there, if you believe their opinion. And that means that this world is an illusion because there are so many forms and puppets and opinions that you get crazy and then you have your own opinion also. <sighs> Chaos. But it is only a play in your mind, in the screen of your consciousness. And you, the one um, observing, you are awareness. You are free of all that doings, that shouting and that noises and that uh, blah, blah, blah. It is in your own mind that it plays. So, pff, let it be. You cannot stop it and you cannot push it faster. It is not, it is not real, so you cannot do anything about it. Only thing is, again and again, turn back to that open place, the possibility from where all arises. And don't go in that what arises. But if you do, and you will, keep remembering that it is just a play on the screen of your mind. The whole world is inside of you, and you are the observer. Don't get involved. <laughs>